Hello everybody, this is Angie at Cuckoo for Coupons and I am at CVS today to do my CVS haul. So I'm not gonna spend a lot of time talking because I wanna get to shopping, so let's get inside. Okay, so for my first transaction, I am gonna be working with a 10 off of 70. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab the laundry products first. This week, if you spend $30 on select P&G products, you're gonna get $10 back in extra care bucks. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab the Tide Liquid. It's on sale this week for $12.99. It's the 92 ounce bottle. We do have a $3 digital coupon in the CVS app, so make sure you clip that. My second item, I'm gonna grab some of the Tide Pods. They are $5.49 this week, and we do have a $1 digital in the CVS app. My third item, I'm gonna gra grab some of the Gain Liquid. This week it's $6.99, and we do have a $1 digital on that as well in the CVS app. And then for my fourth item, to meet my $30, I'm gonna grab some of the Downy Unstoppable Scent Beads. They are $5.49 this week with a $1 digital in the CVS app. So these are the four products I'm gonna buy. They total $30.96. So I have met my $30 to get the $10 extra buck back. After coupons, it's gonna be $24.96. We do have that $10 extra buck coming back, making them $14.96 for all four, or just $3.74 a piece. But we are gonna include this with our spend 70, get 10, so it's gonna be an even better deal. Next up, I am gonna grab some deodorant. So the Dove Men Plus Care is priced at $8.29 in my store. This week they are on sale, buy one, get one 50% off. And this week, if you buy either Dove, Schmitz, or Degree deodorant, if you buy four of them, you're gonna get a $10 extra buck. So I'm gonna grab four. As you can see, my store is almost out of them but I'm gonna grab four of the ones that are priced at $8.29. So at buy one, get one 50% off. The second one should be about $4.14. So two of them will ring up at $8.29 and two of them at $4.14. My subtotal is gonna be $24.86. We do have insert coupons. So grab two of those. They are $4 off of two. You're gonna use two of them. But then we also have a digital coupon that is also $4 off of two, and it will glitch and come off with the other two insert coupons. So now your total is gonna be $12.86. We're gonna get that $10 extra buck back, making these just $2.86 for four, or just 71 cents each, which is amazing. Next up, I am gonna grab some CoverGirl. This is becoming a weekly thing, I think. So the cheapest ones in my store are $5.29. And this week, the CoverGirl is buy two and get a $6 extra buck. So I'm gonna grab two of those. That's gonna to total me $10.58. We do have insert coupons for $3 off of one. So use two of those. That's gonna take $6 off. Your subtotal is then gonna be $4.58. We're going to get that $6 extra buck, making these free plus a $1.42 moneymaker. Next up, I'm going to grab some of the U by Kotex Barely There liners. It's the 18 count. So this week, the U by Kotex is buy one, get one 50% off. And if you buy two, you get a $2 extra buck. So grab two of these little liners. The first one is gonna ring up at $1.99 and the second one at 50% off, so it's gonna be 99 cents. Your total is gonna be $2.98, but you're gonna get that $2 extra buck back, making both of them just 98 cents or just 49 cents each. So for my last two items on this receipt, I decided to grab some of the Garnier Fructis. I grabbed one shampoo and one conditioner. This week they are on sale two for $8, buy two and get a $3 extra buck. So here's the thing. I had a three off of two digital coupon and you should have it as well, but mine wouldn't work. No matter how many times I tried to add it to my account, it kept saying there was an error. Luckily I had these printable $3 coupons that I had printed at some other point 
They were one day expired, but I was able to use it. So if you have the printable and you can get your digital to work, they probably will glitch and come off together. But I went ahead and just used the one printable because my $3 digital just absolutely would not work. So they were $8. My $3 printable brought them down to $5 for two. I got back a $3 extra buck, which made them $2 for two or just a dollar a piece. If you could get both of them to work, they're going to be an even better deal. So now that everything is over $70, I'm going to go ahead and head to the register. All right, let's check out my receipts. So you can see I got the two Garnier Fructis. I got the Gain, the two Tide, the Downy. I got the four deodorants, the two UI Kotex, and the two CoverGirl. I used two $3 insert coupons for the CoverGirl, two $4 insert coupons for the deodorant, and that $3 printable coupon for the Garnier Fructis. My $4 digital for the deodorant, the Dove Men Plus Care, did glitch and come off. I used my $3 digital for the Tide Liquid, my $1 for the Tide Pods, the $1 for the Downy, and the $1 for the Gain. I used my 10 off of 70, and then I just rolled extra bucks. Always roll your extra bucks. That's how you get your subtotal all the way down. My subtotal ended up being $0.00. I only paid tax for this transaction. I then got back $31 and extra bucks that I can use on my next transactions. So very important to roll those extra bucks. Also, I submitted my receipt to Fetch Rewards. I got a whole whopping 35 cents back, but it's very important to submit your receipts to those rebate apps because you can make a lot of money that way. I have my PayPal debit card attached to my rebate apps. That way, all of the money from my rebate apps goes onto my PayPal account, and then I use my PayPal debit card to pay for all of my transactions. So I'm just constantly rolling couponing money, and I never have to go and use like my own cash or my own bank account. Sometimes I'll use gift cards, like fetch gift cards or something, but typically I only use my PayPal debit card to pay, which is all money that I have earned from those rebate apps. So download those rebate apps because they are a great tool to save money. My referral codes are below the video if you want to use them. You don't have to if you don't want to, but they're there if you need them. For my second transaction, I am going to be working with an 8 off of 40, and I did switch accounts. So the first items I'm going to grab are the Cottonelle. So this week, if you buy $20 in participating products, you're going to get a $5 extra buck. The Cottonelle is part of that deal. So I'm going to grab two of the two packs of Cottonelle wipes. They are two for 10. So now we're at $10 of that 20. There is a $1 digital coupon in the CVS app that you can use on one pack. And then you can print off this $1 coupon from the Cottonelle website on the second pack. So now I need to grab these items to make it 20. So I'm going to grab two of the toilet paper that is also two for 10. We don't have any digital coupons that I know of on these, but we do have printable coupons also on the Cottonelle website. So I'm going to use one of those. If you have two, go ahead and use them. I only had one. I also think that we got some Cottonelle coupons in the new inserts. So go ahead and check your inserts for those as well. So now we're at $20, but we have $3 in coupons. So now we're down to $17. We're gonna get that $5 extra buck back, making all four of these items $12 or just $3 a piece. So for the rest of this transaction, I just got some of the items that I had already gotten. So I'm just gonna show you the receipt now. All right, let's check out this second receipt. So you can see I got the two Cottonelle toilet paper, the two Cottonelle wipes. I did get four more of the Dove Men Plus Care. I grabbed one just like the other ones. But then I grabbed three of the, I think they were just kind of different scents. So they were a few cents more, but I just went ahead and did it again because that's still a good deal. And then I got two of the U by Kotex again, and then I did the two CoverGirl again. So you can see I used my two $4 insert coupons for the Dove Men Plus Care deodorant. I used my two $3 coupons for the CoverGirl. My $1 printable coupon for the Cottonelle wipes, my $1 printable for the Cottonelle toilet paper, 
my $4 Dove Men Plus Care deodorant coupon did glitch and come off again. I used my $1 Cottonelle Digital, and then I used an 8 off of 40 I rolled some extra bucks, and my subtotal for this transaction ended up being $0.63. Cents. And then, of course, I paid taxes. So $0.63, cents, I ended up getting back $23 in extra bucks, and then I got $2.35 back from Fetch, and then $1.12 back from Shopkick. So I was happy with that transaction. And that is it. That is everything I got from my CVS haul this week. There were a couple of other things that I wanted to get, but my store didn't have them. And I'm going to need to search around to see what store does have them. So I don't know if I'll get them or not, but if I do, I'll end up posting a video, I'm sure. But in the end, I got $178 worth of product and I got it all for free, plus a $3.19 moneymaker. Also, just a reminder, we do have the Epic Beauty event happening right now. So a lot of the items that I'm buying and that I'm sure other people are buying should be tracking towards that. The only thing is, I don't know where it's tracking at, and I don't know if anybody does. If you guys know where it's tracking, please let me know, because I don't see it anywhere in my app. I don't see it on my receipts. I don't see it anywhere. I hope that it's tracking somewhere. <laughs> I guess we'll all find out. But uh, if you know, please let me know in the comments. And lastly, I just want to say thank you guys so much for watching my videos. I have said this before and I'll keep saying it. I love making these videos. So I love that you guys are watching. If you have any suggestions, any questions, anything like that, please leave them in the comments. I will get back to you as soon as I can on them. And other than that, if you want to subscribe to my channel, that would be amazing. If you want to hit that thumbs up button, that would also be amazing. Every little bit will help me out. I hope you guys have a wonderful day and good luck couponing. Bye.